the old experiment. That's a lot of information to go on. Anyway, been waiting so long to say this. Hey, Ray Klaus here. Welcome to my new Let's Play of Perfect Dark. Oh my God. Okay. Yeah. This is basically my bar none my favorite FPS there is. And okay, can can I destroy that? Thank you. Okay. Trying to sneak behind this guy and there you go. Just taken down. Okay. Now. The okay, starting off here, kind of going down this um, this kind of central building of Data Corporation, which is kind of like a technology comp technological company. Which I can got to be honest here, if I'm if I can work for either Data Nine or um, Carrington Institute, it, I I'd say with Data Nine as bad as that sounds. I'll get more into that later on, but yeah. Take down these um, security cameras because they, they will ca ca cause trouble. Hey, for this first mission here, I'm gonna mine that. Yeah, mine your own business. Okay, that was terrible. Okay, so the way this works is, with the exception of like three missions, agent mode will typically have three objectives. Special agent will have four, and perfect dark, a per perfect agent will have five. Okay, thank you for that. I kind of prefer this over Goldeneye in a way. But what you do is flip that, unlock this, and knock you out. As um, Carrington was saying, you don't want to kill her because that will render the key useless and thus failing us the mission entirely. So, yeah, that's why we go in, switch it to um, Pistol Whip. Okay, I don't know if you notice. Okay, actually, um, I don't know why you won't notice, but this is a um, PLA version of the game. It's kind of odd of me to play the XPLA version since I'm not the biggest Xbox fan in the world. But honestly, I kind of do prefer the Xbox version, and dare I say, I kind of find it to be the definitive version. And there's oh. I already told. Okay, so kind of I was kind of paranoid. Usually there's a guard sitting here, but I guess he just kind of moved out, moved out of the room. Now I won't really admit I'm not ex I'm not exactly the best perfect dark player of all, which um is kind of made evident from the fact that I'm playing super carry headshot. I wonder what difficulty you're playing, if you can kind of head up to my tennis card. I guess if you're really good at aiming, you might want to do that. I guess if you're really good at the game, you wouldn't need to necessarily. <laughs> but yeah, the best course of action here since um, Private Agent mode doesn't give you um, a whole lot of ammo to work with. Is that uh, you do want to go around here and kind of build up uh, as much ammo as you can? And oh, what was that? A, yep. Uh, okay, guess someone's gun fell on the um lift. Now go and take that oh, quick. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I, I don't appreciate that elevator. Cl Trying to close the door on me. Oh, whatever. Just wanna. Yaddy! <laughs> okay, uh, <laughs> I don't know why I find that funny. I guess it is too. Also, yeah, it's just kind of weird. It's just. I don't know. 
Okay, now there are plenty of hidden weapons throughout, throughout each mission. One of them is right down this corner, actually. Okay, I'm gonna just go and get that without triggering one of the obje upcoming objectives here. I want to take out this security cam. Cause yeah, don't know how soon the um, security system is gonna come back online. Oh, I didn't want to trigger that quite yet. That's primarily why. Okay, now you don't want to um, force this guy into um, helping you quite yet, because, yeah, you, you do want him to r run off. Why? Because you'll see he's running towards that door over there. You can get a lot top gun ass. I'm like, are you can get double fucking two silencers? So, yeah, there's two hidden weapons. Right off the bat, and ignore the elephant in the room here. The yeah, CMP-150, which is basically a daytime um, standard issue. It's one of the um, two first um, potential um, automatic weapons that you'll find. Which is pretty cool, I gotta admit. But, when I go back to the um, fucking two silencer, as I kinda wanna have the pistol whip here. You don't wanna kill this guy. But more the hell? Uh, what the heck happened to the... That's weird. The... What the heck happened to the radical? Okay, that is ri- Oh, the radical shows up in the dead- of course. Oh, dumb in pistol whip mode. That's why. I'm an idiot. I'm a moron. Dave close pay attention. Is why you record me? It is late night. Dude. Uh, whatever. Yeah, it's. I don't know why I'm recording this right now. I don't know. I guess this kind of felt like it. Anyway, yeah, pretty much weapons will have secondary functionalities such as racing ammo, sure! <laughs> Hit the wrong button. Hit the trigger, not the bumper. Using the white right bumper, you can switch weapon functionalities, which is, um, follow lock on. It's what it says on the box. Target enemy, you lock onto them, and the radical follows it. Is it a useful functionality? No. What is useful is a sentry gun. Just throw it there. Let the gun do the work. Suffering a lot of damage here, but at the at the very same time, made fairly quick work of these data nine data nine troops. And if you're playing the XBLA version of the game, there is actually an achievement for um, killing 50 um, data nine guards with um, on top gun in the sentry mode. So, yeah, if that's if you're an achievement hunter, definitely consider doing that. Okay, take you guys down. There's one over here that I haven't killed yet. Okay, there we go. Down goes the NA shock troops. There's one more hub that we need to use that for, and there we go. External comms hub is taken down. You know what? You know what? I'm not. Damn this computer! Because why not? <laughs> Seriously, why not? 
Now there's four more troops down down this way. It is it is feasible that if you're low on health like I am, you can die to these troops. Like speaking of, yeah, this is a great omen. This really sets the tune for. Um, down the line, to say the very least, but we made it. We made it to the laboratory lift. Okay. I guess that does it. Next time, it's the data in central basement, where we search for Dr. Carroll. See you guys then. Also, I love this music and the graphic is beautiful. <laughs>